Today, we'll be going over the top five upsets from the Big Ten Championships. So first off, we got a 14 seed in Brody Teske taking out Nick Buzakis. And you might be thinking, how is this at number five? But really, it should have been Teske getting a top six seed at the very least. They screwed up the seeding with this one and Teske came in as the last seed in the championships. And he was getting dogged by Buzakis for the first half of the match. I mean, Buzakis was up 10 to two after getting this slick takedown off of a reshot. And it was not looking good for Teske. But then Teske would come back near the end of the second period, get a nice low double to help close the gap between him and Buzakis. But then it would look like Buzakis would put the match away as Teske would go for a throw and Buzakis would be able to counter and defend it successfully. But Teske would get an escape, fire off another low level shot, and then get the takedown. And as he's cutting Buzakis, slap in a cradle, get four near fall and then end up winning the match as they would say time would run out before Buzakis could get a reversal to tie the match. It was a crazy match, high scoring, and yeah, they really screwed up the seating with this one. Then we got number two Drake Ayala getting knocked off by the seventh seed, Michael Diagostino. Diagostino would have an underhook and try to shuck it by to get to the leg, but then they would end up in a scramble and it would look like Ayala is in good defensive position, but Diagostino would keep on hustling, scoop around, get the single leg, and then finish the match with a nice double leg takedown to get the huge upset. Then we got Bernie Truax taking out Lenny Pinto with just a beautiful takedown in the third period. You might be thinking why we include this one, it's a three versus two, but we included it because Truax is ranked number seven nationally and Pinto is ranked number two. But yeah, just a great match from another Penn State guy. Should be a great final tomorrow. Then we got Will Luan taking out Brayden Lee. And surprise, surprise, this match was one to one and went to overtime. But it looked like Luan was gonna get taken down near the end of the third period. I mean, Lee was pretty deep in on a single leg and Luan would almost be on his back, but he would move off the under over position, just go straight to underhook and take the match to overtime where he would do a great job using feints to set up a takedown and then finish with a strong double leg to go to the finals. Great match from Luan. And then at number one, we got the one seed, Matt Ramos, getting taken out by Dean Peterson. Peterson just wrestled a phenomenal match. I mean, he scored in the second period with a nice takedown from a submarine position right at the end of the second period, not even giving Ramos a chance to escape. And then it looked like Ramos was in pretty deep at the end of the third, but Peterson just kept on hustling, kept on scrambling, got into a funky position, but was just able to get his hips on top and get the takedown. Great match from Dean Peterson, knocking off the one seed in Matt Ramos. This weight class is crazy. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. Comment down below what are your predictions for the Big Ten Finals and NCAAs. And subscribe for more content like this. Peace.